always in the heart of middle of winter. Could be eight or nine years ago. We saw these three people getting out of the car, Americans. Big coats, scarves, whoa. And I just happened to be going down the steps at the same time. They're looking in amazement. And one of them said to me, we're from Florida. Are you guys really going in there? I said, there's two or three of them in already. Gee, it must be cold, he says. At this stage, there was a few people gathered round there where we walk into the water. Are you members of a club? So one of the lads said, ah, yeah, various clubs. Got a name? First of all, there's the challenge, will you go in? You have to build your own confidence that you're going to go and do this. My heart starts pumping, my blood flows quicker. It makes me feel better and stronger, and I feel that's why I enjoy it. It's all about the connection with, that you're part of something bigger, that it gets you out of yourself. So you're not obsessed by anything anymore. No problems, no projection to the future, no living in the past. It is just, just living in the moment. So the swimming is like a baptism. You go in and you come out kind of cleansed every way. All your worries and cares are gone and you're refreshed and you've forgotten all about them. One of the most purest form of connection with nature is to be in there. And it's so free, so unpretentious, it's so real, it's so, it's so pure. I am unfortunate in so far as I suffer from depression, severe depression. And that doesn't go away, it comes back with a vengeance. But I've had some horrendous times, I didn't care if I lived or died. I'll never forget, I was only new there, and my husband was in hospital, and he was very, very sick. And they were investigating him, and he sent me a text, and he said it was confirmed Legionnaire's disease. If I hadn't been in that group, I'd have been at home and I would have heard the news. And I'd have no one to um, support me. I found even at my worst, when I get into that water and get out, I feel better. Lourdes, that's what I call it, Lourdes water. No, it's, it's a magic place, I think. We'd meet people. I might meet somebody out there. Why don't you come and join us? Wendy is be here. Sunday morning, I'll be here. Is it all right if I bring a friend? No, everyone does their own thing. I think that everybody lives it in a different way. So you can share the experience, but it's very difficult that you share the same emotions. I think that I found the missing piece in these 15 years that I'm in Ireland, the missing piece to finally be happy in winter. And I just think that is incredible. Normally, if I come out, and if there was no one there, and, and I, I won't go in on my own anymore. And if I'd wait for half an hour, and maybe if no one would go, I'd go home and I'd be raging, you know? I'd be disappointed.
It's amazing how in five minutes everything changes. It changes your perspective on everything. Angela's terrible word, isn't it? <laughs>